welcome to the channel. Today we'll be looking at the EasyViz CB3 battery powered security camera that comes with a solar panel in the kit. So it's easy to install and many years of use with little to no maintenance required. Now one of the biggest hurdles with security cameras is the required wiring. Some need power over ethernet that requires a specialized router to send power to the camera, while others just need power to be sent to the camera via a power adapter brick. The CB3 security camera sets to overcome this with the included solar panel. So let's dive on in and see what this attractive feature rich camera is all about. In the box, you get the camera itself, which is a bullet shout with dimensions of 106 millimeters long by 63 millimeters across. So it's a compact design, especially when you consider this camera packs a 5,200 milliamp battery. More on that later. Included is a 40 centimeter USB-A to micro USB charging cable. But since we have solar included, you're unlikely to be using this outside of the initial charging and setup of the camera. There is a well-engineered simple mount that affixes via the two included screws. The mounting provides 360 degrees around a 90 degree pivot around the axis, so you can get that perfect viewing angle. Included in the kit is the solar panel, the metal mount, screws and raw plugs, plus a mounting sticker for easy hole location and drilling. The metal solar mounting allows for a full 360 degrees of rotation with 180 degrees around the axis so you can orient this to the optimal sun collection angle. The solar panel is monocrystalline and provides 4.2 watts, so you will fully charge your camera even on those overcast days. The solar panel mounts to the mounting arm has a universal mounting screw, so that you can use the included mount or similar from other manufacturers if required. To allow for optimal placement, the panel has a 4 meter cable, which is great to see, and with the included cable tie, you can neatly conceal that behind the panel. Simply drill the holes using the included mounting template as a guide and then screw the mount in position. Attach the camera to the mount by screwing onto the threaded screw. Position your camera and screw the base mount to lock the camera into its orientation. The solar panel mounting is just as simple. Make sure you position your solar panel within four meters of the camera and so that it receives a few hours of direct sunlight each day. Then connect your solar panel to your camera and you're done. Setup of the EasyViz CB3 could not be easier. Firstly, make sure you are connected to the 2.4 gigahertz Wi-Fi and not the five gigahertz network as the CB3 does not work with the five gigahertz range frequency. Download the EasyViz app from the App Store or the Google Play Store. Links in the description. Once installed, create an account. Just in case the camera has discharged itself while in storage, connect your CB3 camera using the included 40 centimeter USB cable to a USB power source. The camera will tell you to please use the EasyViz app for Wi-Fi configuration. In the app, press the Add Device. Select your camera. Use the camera on your phone to scan the QR code on the bottom of the camera. This can be quite sensitive, so make sure it's about 20 centimeters away. The app will retrieve device information. Now confirm that your camera is turned on and select the radio button and press next. The app will give you a description of the actions it's about to perform. Now press start. The app will ask you to confirm the device is powered on and in setup mode, which is the signified by the blue flashing light on the front of the camera. Press the indicator flashes blue and press next. Select your 2.4 gigahertz Wi-Fi and enter your Wi-Fi password and press next. The app will now try and connect your CB3 directly to your Wi-Fi. Press the join. Once joined, the app will ask you if you wish to change the name of the camera and where it is located. Optionally set these as required and press done. The setup will complete and add the camera to your account and automatically drop you into the configuration of the camera, which you can follow through. This relatively inexpensive camera comes with a 1080p resolution with a variable quality from standard definition all the way up to super clear 1080p. Although in difficult lighting situations, don't expect miracles. Battery life is stellar as you would expect with such a large battery and integrated solar. 
In my testing, it took several days to complete the charge of the battery from the solar panel, but once charged, under normal daylight conditions, there was no appreciable drop in the battery charge over a day. Yes, I'm in Australia, but I still don't believe this would be an issue even in a less sunny country. The motion detection is tunable to detect human presence as opposed to just movement, so you can avoid those recordings of trees moving. This works very well, but the range of the detection is limited to around about 10 meters, as it needs to detect it's a person moving as opposed to anything else. So select your user cases for this camera wisely. Color night vision was a standout feature for this camera. Its floodlights are powerful and the onboard image processing made the images vivid and colorful. The design is robust and well engineered, so I have no doubt that in normal weather conditions, the weatherproof design will endure. I'm planning on a follow-up video of my security cameras in about 12 months for a long-term test. Hit the subscribe button and ding that bell to be notified of when that video comes out. My neighbors can attest to the fact that the siren is very loud. And although no figure is quoted by EasyViz, it's comparable with the C3W camera at about 100 decibels. You get the option for two-way talk. This is very much internet dependent, but in my testing, this achieved a latency of around about two seconds. So don't expect long conversations. You get the inclusion of H.265 for super compressed video streams to keep your bandwidth requirements nice and low. Easy integration into Google and Amazon ecosystems. Support for micro SD cards up to 256 gigabytes and the EasyViz cloud storage. If you do want to keep your recordings in the cloud for security purposes, then you can try free for seven days and then plans start from $3.99 per month for a single camera to through to $12.99 for 10 cameras. Links in the description. Now with the Home Assistant integration, it's a mixed bag. Yes, you can integrate EasyViz cameras into Home Assistant. You'll see some great sensor data, such as motion sensors and battery charge information. You'll also be able to set various different camera settings, such as detection sensitivity, audio warning sounds, turn on the floodlights, and even remote activate the loud siren. However, you cannot see the live feed. This appears that the RTSP stream comes deactivated and that you simply cannot turn this back on, either through the app or via hack into the EasyViz Studio. I tried all the suggested ways to activate this and none worked. Links in the description to the discussion. So I emailed EasyViz technical support and was advised that all battery powered EasyViz cameras do not support RTSP. Maybe this will change in future and I'm sure that EasyViz are doing this to preserve the battery life of the camera. So if you are looking for a live feed into Home Assistant, then maybe look at the PoE cameras or mains powered cameras. So if you still want to set up your EasyViz camera into Home Assistant to obtain the sensor and controls, this is super simple. If your EasyViz camera is not auto discovered, head to Settings, Devices and Services. Press the blue button in the bottom right hand corner for Add Integration. Search for and select EasyViz. Enter your username and password that you used in the app. Select the top URL for EasyVizLive.com and press Submit. You will now see two devices listed in the integration. Optionally set the area if required and press finish. Now press the two devices link on the integration. Select the EasyViz alarm. Press add to dashboard. Select your dashboard and press next. Now add to dashboard. Press the back arrow in the top left hand corner. Select the second device and repeat for the controls. And for sensors. And finally, for the configuration. Now navigate to your dashboard. You should now see an alarm panel, all of the sensors that are available, plus all of the controls that are available from the actual application. Note that the live recording does not show. So the EasyViz CB3 Solar Kit, what do I think? Well, firstly, it's a great camera with an astounding battery life, good clarity, and a rich feature set. It's weatherproof, simple to install and configure, has onboard person detection, a loud siren, and very bright floodlights. 
Combine this with full integration with Google and Amazon Alexa, and all this for a very attractive $129. Links in the description. However, if you are looking for Home Assistant live streaming, then you're going to be disappointed, at least for the moment. There might be a Hacks integration become available later, similar to what ARLO did for the Arlo cameras. Links in the description to that video. But at least for the moment, you are limited to sensors and controls. I hope you enjoyed the video, and if you did, consider subscribing to the channel, becoming a member, and dinging that bell. And maybe a super thanks or buy me a coffee, where all the scripts of the videos you watch are stored. Until the next one, enjoy your hassle-free sun-powered security cameras.